Welcome back to Stardew Valley, episode 19. Okay. Go out here. Get these things watered. Now we have a little money, I think we're gonna stop by the guild and see about maybe getting another sword upgrade. Or see if they got another sword they can sell me that's stronger. Alright, so working on my silo. I wonder how many days it'll take. Go hit the mine, I guess. Once the silo gets built, I'm gonna start collecting grass. See if I can get the silo filled up before I buy some chickens. Spicy bear. What? Oh, I was collecting the berries for the um for the what are the little creature things called? I can't remember. I can't remember what I had. Um, let's see, grape, spicy berry, uh, sweet pea? Oh, I already have a spicy berry. Uh, what else did I need? I'll have to go back and check. Let's put them in this chest so I know that I'm collecting them. Matter of fact, we can do that now. Let's go see what I need. If I already have the items, I'll come back and get them. There's a grape right there. Oh, there's two grapes. Where does this bus go? Evidently nowhere. I can't use it. Do you gotta buy a ticket first? The bus to Calico Desert is out of service. No, it's not. It's right there. Alright, two grapes. That one's got a silver star. The difference, okay, it gives you more energy and more health. I need to go on the forums and see if anybody has suggested adding a sprint button. Because I could get behind that. was over this way, wasn't it? Um, spring construction. Oops, wrong button. Oh, wood, wood, stone, har hardwood. How do you get hardwood? Okay. Fall. We're looking for summer, right? Oh, okay, I already have the stuff. Wow, well, let's go back and pick up the spicy berry and then we'll come and drop these off. decided who I want to try to romance yet, so. I think we won't even worry about that until maybe uh, towards the end of the second year, maybe the third year even. First we got uh, um, 
establish, you know, a good working farm. Man, why do I keep doing that? Oh, I, put, I just put him in the other chest. Come on, use your brain. Okay, that's all I need. Let's go drop these off and see what it does. I wonder how you do rep how do you repair this place? Bundle complete. All right. So what does that do? Oh, whoa. Oh, another book! Okay. Oh, another book there, too. Okay, so is that is that how you do repairs? Uh, bridge repair. Oh, it gives you a reward? I got some... Summer seeds associated with the wild summer. Okay. Wait, the... Oh, reward, bridge repair. Ah, oh, does that mean they're gonna repair the bridge? Or does that mean it unlocks the bridge for repair? Hey, look, you can see the little guy walking around now. Oops. Can't click on him or talk to him, though. So what's he doing? Oh, is he, he's delivering the bundle that I just gave him? Oh, okay, cool. Let's go check out this book. Pantry. Oh, okay, so to, uh, to do repairs to each portion, let's see, reward, greenhouse. So if I can get all these rewards, I'll unlock the greenhouse. Then if I get all the things for here... It unlocks the bridge repair. So it could take up to a year to get each one of these done. But you can work on multiple at the same time, I guess. So if they each have a spring bundle, let's see. Oh yeah, see this one has a summer bundle also. And tomato, hot pepper, blueberry, and melon. And these are all things you'd have to grow. Okay. This is very interesting. I was wondering how they were going to do this. Lake fish bundle. Oh no, there's a fish in one. Yeah, see reward. Uh, glittering boulder removed. Glittering boulder removed. You mean like the one that's on my farm? Well, that's kind of crap. Large map of bass, uh, a carp, a bullhead, and a stur sturgeon. Okay. Oops. Man, I keep clicking the wrong buttons. Night fish. So there's, all, there's certain fish you can only catch at night. River fish. Is that a catfish? Yeah, it is. The whiskers. Oh my, look at this. Lobster, crawfish, crab, uh, cockle, crockle, uh, mussel, shrimp, snail, periwinkle, uh, oyster, and a clam. What the heck is a periwinkle? And you only need five 
out of these things. Okay. So the same way with the no, the other ones you need okay. Uh ocean fish. Red snapper. Specialty fish. Ooh, a puffer fish. That's cute. Ghost fish. Uh, sand fish. Ew. And wood skip. Alright. The fishing one's gonna be hard. Um, I really don't like the fishing game, mini game on here. And I guess all these are crops, right? Whoa. Let's see, turnip oil, cloth, goat cheese, cheese, honey, jelly, apple, apri uh, apricot, orange, peach, pomegranate, and cherry. So I'm guessing these are all things that can be made. And these are all raw ingredients. Let's see, I think all of these grow on trees, don't they? Do cherries grow on vines? I really don't know. I know the apple, the orange, and the peach all grow. These three grow on trees. I'm not sure about the, the ap apricot. Pomegranate, I'm not really sure either. Cloth. I'm guessing that is if you have sheep and you would need a, a spinning wheel probably to turn it into cotton. And then you would need, um, oh god, what's it called? I want to say an arm, but I think that's wrong. You know, the, the thing you, you use to weave it into, uh, like, rugs or um, shirts. I don't even know if all that's in the game or not. This is a lake, I guess, or a, uh, a river. So this is probably where you catch the river fish. Okay. What time is it? 3 p.m.? Let's go buy the guild and see about buying a sword. See if they got one stronger than what I'm using. I can also check on the status of filling them quest along here. Let's see, level 3, 8 to 15, plus 1 defense. It, uh, seriously, it's not gonna tell me how much mine does. I have a silver saver, so I have this. So, sneakers, 1 defense. I wish there's a way to easily compare what you have to what's being sold. Increase weapon precision by 10%. Increases knockback by 10%. Do I have a ring equipped? No, I don't. Oh, and I got two ring slots. Hmm, there should be a mod that lets you have 10 ring slots. Because you technically have four fingers and two thumbs, and you can wear a ring on each. And I mean, technically, you could stack rings on your finger until the very, you know, tip of your finger. So you should be able to wear way more than 10 rings. 
I hate when people put artificial limitation like that, especially when you have a clothing system. If you're gonna have a clothing system where it's built in, you need to build a real clothing system. Ugh, so annoying. And this is why I make mods to fix crap like that. Ooh, that's cool, you can get to it from here. Good to know, I won't have to go all the way back to the, uh... Where is the reward? Is it posted here? Or do you have to talk to this guy? Come back when you've got something to show me, kid. Where is the... Hmm. I could've swore it was... Oh, okay, it's on the wall right here. Thought it was. Help us keep the valley safe. I need a thousand slimes. I'm at 35. Cave insects, wow, I'm getting them. I would say, let's see, 50. Da, da, I'm a little under halfway. So let's go to the cave then until uh, 8, and we'll kill some stuff. The insect one is going to be easier than the slime one, I bet, because uh, last time I was in the cave, there was a floor that was nothing but insects. Oh yeah, the fishing thing. I forgot all about that. Even though I did it last time I was here, I haven't actually, uh, haven't played since last time I was here, so that was almost three weeks ago. No, don't turn into oh those flying insect things are so annoying. Still need to find out if there's a way to cook that bug meat. Don't you dare. Oh, okay. Why did the stuff turn green like that? Did it do that before? I just not notice it? Oh my god. Oh, there's another one. Is it because it's after dark now? Jesus. Yeah, I guess I'll just stand right here for a minute, maybe another... Now the green stuff is gone, what? Let's deal with that. Okay, whatever, let's go down the floor. Um, uh, I remember this floor. Can't hardly see down here. Yeah, the bug one's gonna be a lot easier to get than the slime one. Oh look, there's two different ladders going down. Already flies. Oh look, another ladder. If I keep going after the bugs, I might actually make it down to level 25. Well no, it's already 8 p.m. Um, so, let's go ahead and get out. Thing is, is I only need to go on. Nah, do nothing. Don't go. I only need one more floor to get to the next. To unlock the next area. So let's look for it. Problem is, I don't see any bugs or anything to kill. Oh, what is that over there? Oh, there's a the ladder. Okay, we're we'll gonna come back to the ladder in a minute. I wanna go check out what it looked like there was a bunch of crates and stuff over here. Whoa, awesome. Sweet. Guess this was uh, a warehouse or something at one point. It looks like because there's a little path where this would be like the door maybe. 
All right, let's go down one more floor. We'll get 25 unlocked. Sweet. Okay, let's kill this slime. Oh, there's a ladder, but we're, we gotta get it out of here. Sweet, we got 425 unlocked. Okay, let's head back to the house. So for winter time, I need to, or not winter, fall, wait, yeah, fall is next. I need to plan to grow the stuff that I need to do the uh, for this place. Oh, why didn't I go straight? I'm taking the bloody long way. Oh well. I also need to get another tool upgraded. Let's see, slime. Oh, there's hardwood. A special kind of wood with superior strength and beauty. Okay. Let's keep the copper, get rid of the stone. White algae? Hang on to that. Bug meat. Fiber. I can take all these out since I'm not collecting them anymore. All right, let's go hit the bed. All right, level two combat plus five HP, new crafting recipe, life elixir. Oh, cool. Alright, summer's rapidly coming to an end. Um, let's look up that life elixir. How do you make it? Whoa. Oh, it's cooking? Does that mean you can't make it from here? Red mushroom, purple mushroom, morsel, and... Chanterella? Where in the heck do I find all these things? Cuts the duration of negative status effects in half. Ten copper bars, uh, five refined quartz, and earth crystals. Earth crystals will be the hardest thing to find there. Cherry bomb. Uh, generates small explosions stand back. Well, what would be the use of that? Wild seeds, huh? Oh, okay. Let's get some watering done. I'm gonna need to refill my watering can though, because I was sprinkling it all over the place, just getting everything wet like a crazy person. How many more times I'll be able to harvest these before the end of the month? Say at least twice. More than likely. Whoa, she's already done building my silo? That was quick. Now, how do I um, use it? Uh, 
Um, let's get the sight down. Oh, it does it automatically! Nice! Now how can I check how much is in there? Okay, um, pieces of hay, three, okay, so it holds 240. That is not bad. Not bad at all. And, uh, oh, there's some more grass. So uh, that's the that's the difference of using the scythe. The scythe gets you hay, and the uh, sword just cuts the grass. That's what I'm taking away from it. All right. So if I collect hay until I'd say winter time, I should be able to have enough to buy chickens then. At least that's the plan. Okay. Looking good. Looking good. Okay, well, um, we are going to wrap the episode up right here. Um, if you like this episode, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe so you don't miss the next episode. Hope to see you next time.